Hello everybody, uh, welcome to my channel. Be kind, this is my first video. And I just got the new 2021 Apollo Explorer electric scooter. This is now my fourth electric scooter actually. And I got the idea to start to uh, make some videos about them. I can compare them. I know I always look for review videos before I pick the one I'm gonna get next. So I figured I might be able to help you guys as well. Um, this first one here is just a quick unboxing. I was trying to look for a, a video of a 2021 Apollo Explorer and couldn't find any. So I think I might be the first person who has this new design and figured you guys might wanna take a look. I'll plan to do a deeper review a little later and then tell you what other scooters I have and start uh, comparing them so you can see which one you like best. Um, but to start with the Explorer, uh, as you can see here, it looks pretty similar to the last one if you're familiar with the Explorer. I'm hoping you've seen other reviews that are probably more in-depth. This is kind of focusing on what's new for 2021. They did mention three big things for 2021 that were supposed to be different. The first one was supposed to be a more rigid kickstand, um, which you can see here. And I don't have the old one, uh, obviously, to do a direct comparison. I'm sure you can find those photos online, but that's the new kickstand. The other big change was they changed the deck to match their ghost scooter. So now the deck shape is a little different, as you can see. Um, what that also did uh, was give it a little bit better lighting. And as you'll see in a bit, it gave it uh, an extra charging port actually that they didn't mention before. So now I think you can plug in two slow chargers to get a fast charge if you didn't have a single fast charger. They also mentioned the fenders being updated. So they have stronger rear and front fenders that are supposedly not gonna break as much. I guess they were having problems with that in the past. Those are the main changes they mentioned was the, the shape of the deck, kickstand, and the fenders. And everything else should be about the same. I don't know for sure, but um, go ahead and take a look. Here I just turn it on, finish building it, put on the lights. The lights I think are uh, about the same. It does have better front headlights and rear tail lights now because of the bigger deck. But I think the blue stem light and under light are the same as they used to be. But here's just some different angles. But anyway, yeah, that's just the quick unboxing kind of first look. Get your eyes on it, see if it looks like something you wanna get. I'm sure I'm gonna start doing some reviews on it uh, in the future. And then, like I said, some comparisons between the other scooters I own, which are, uh, there's some good ones. So subscribe and uh, let's see what I got.